All right, guys, today I'm going to show you how to clean your mass air flow sensor on your car. Most cars are the same. They require a little bit different applications to remove it. Some of them have clips, some of them have more clamps. And every time you replace your air flow, it's recommended you clean your mass air flow sensor also. A bottle of CRC mass air flow cleaner costs under five bucks, and it's worth a while. All right, the first thing we do is disconnect the mass air flow sensor. The battery is disconnected already. Set that aside, unscrew the, whole, the clamp that holds the boot on. Let's cut the mask up out of the housing. And let's look inside. And there are contaminants in there. We're going to go out and clean it. Stand I'm going to separate this. we got two clips on each side. You turn them. One on that side, and then you got one here. We want to move the whole mass airflow sensor so we can clean both sides nicely. See that? Not that bad, but look at this side. There are some debris in there. So we're going to go out and clean it anyway. All right, I just want to give you a better view of what's inside this mass airflow sensor. Okay, every time you change your air filter, that's recommended to clean up your mass airflow sensor. And what I'm going to use today is made from CRC. It's a mass airflow sensor cleaner. It's supposed to help you gain a couple of horsepower, which I don't know about. But anyway, it's a good preventive maintenance. And let's go on and see how we're going to do this. All right, we're just going to hit it. This stuff evaporates, so don't worry if it's the floor. It's safe for the sensors. So you have nothing to worry about. Make sure you get it nice and good. All right, now we're going to turn it around. Clean the next side. Now reverse the procedure and pull your maximum flow sensor. Make sure you put the connector back on. Tighten up the clamp. Thanks for watching, guys.